Imangazi has exploded over the last year and his videos have been seen by millions upon millions of people. One of the biggest reasons why is because his videos are simple, pleasing to the eye, and very aesthetic. Many, many people have tried to replicate his style with little to no success. But in this video, I'm going to show you how you can edit your videos like Iman Ghazi to have the same simple and aesthetic style. I'll show you how to get the exact same captions as Iman, the transitions and animations. And you don't have to be an expert or advanced editor. These are simple edits anyone with a brain and a computer can do. So without further ado, let me show you how to get the same caption styles as Iman. Now, if you ever watch a short by Iman, he has these captions that are simple yet very engaging. And to get the same style of captions on your videos, it's actually very simple. All you have to do is use this powerful AI tool called Summit. Let me go to my computer. I'll show you how to add Iman Ghazi style captions to your videos using Submagic. We're now in Submagic and to get Iman Ghazi style captions, it's actually very simple using the software. So first what you have to do is you gotta go to create my video now and then upload any video that you want the captions added to. So we're just gonna upload one real quick. And then what you're gonna notice is that you can also choose the language that you want the captions in and then all you gotta do is press upload. Now it's gonna take some time to get the captions added to it. So we're just gonna restart this when the captions are. Okay, so it is officially done. And now what you're gonna see is that captions have automatically been added to the clip. So for everything that's being said, there's now captions generated for it automatically. So now to turn this into Imangazi style captions, it's super simple from here. All you have to do is go to the design tab and just press Iman. That's it. And then what you're gonna see is that you literally have his exact same style captions for your video. And then what you could do is you can position it wherever you want. If you want it higher or lower on your video, you could change the size of it like that. And then what you can also do is even change the color because his main color uses for white, but if you want to change to a different color, you can't here. So let's say we want to change it to red. What you're gonna see is that some of the words are now gonna be highlighted in red like that. And then if you want, you can also change more about the uh, captions here. You go to custom here, you can also change the size of the shadow. So shadow just means the glow on the back of it. So you can change that up. You can change if you want all of the layers to be uppercase or not. So if you see now they're changed to uppercase and then you can also, what you could do is you also change your own font here as well. So let's say we want to do bangers, wherever this may be. There we go, that's now changed. Uh, but we'll go back and use the same font. And then you also change if you want only on one line or two lines as well. So you can customize the captions as, you know, what, to whatever liking you want, but to just get his style captions, to get Iman's exact style captions, again, all you have to do is upload your video, go to the design tab here, press Iman, and then you will have his style of captions. So that's it. Now that you have Iman style of captions on your video, the next piece of editing you need to learn is how to do the burn transition. Iman does this many times throughout his videos to transition from scene to scene, and you can do this effect very simply still using some magic. Let me show you. Welcome back guys. We're gonna use the same video as before to show you how to get the burn transition in some magic. So to do it, it's very simple. All you have to do is go to the B-rolls tab here and then choose a sentence here where you want a B-roll shot to pop up. So let's say for this one, we want an image here just to pop up for the sentence. We're just gonna choose this robot here since in this message we're saying automate. So we'll choose that. And then what you're gonna see is that when we press this, the shot is gonna come up like that. Now to get the film burn shot, all you have to do is actually press on the image again, go to transitions and then choose which one you want. So I already have it on, but you can choose like slide down. That'll make the photo actually slide down. So what you're gonna see here, like that, it's gonna slide down the frame. But again, we wanna copy Iman Ghazi, so we're gonna have the burn transition. And to do it, all you have to do is press film burn. And then when the image pops up here, it's gonna use that burn transition to show the image. Just like that. So it's very simple to do. Again, you can do this multiple times throughout the video. Just press on image here, whatever it may be. Go to transitions. Again, you can pick whichever one. We're gonna use film burn again. And then when the image pops up, it's gonna do the film burn to go to it. And so that's how to do the burn transition using some magic. Very simple to do. Now the last edit you need to make your videos look like Iman's is this popping up animation he uses time and time again in his videos. It's a simple edit that looks great in a video and makes it more captivating. And let me show you how to do this edit in CapCut. Hey guys, welcome back. We are in CapCut now. And to do the graphic popping up animation, it's very simple to do. So all I have to do is import the video and image that you want and then just drag down, just drag your video down there and then drag down the image that you also want to pop up. So we're gonna put it over here at this part of the video. And then to get to pop up, first what you wanna do is just resize it to the appropriate size. So let's do it like that. We're gonna have it right in the middle popping up. And then to get the animation of it popping up, just go to animation here on the right, make sure the image is selected here. 
just go to animation here and then go to slide up, which is right here. It's prompt. We and then all you want to do is just put the duration at 1.1 seconds. It's almost at the exact same uh, duration that Imangazi also uses. Now, what you're going to see is it's going to slide up into our video here. Just like that. So very simple. And then obviously for however long you want to stay in the video, you can have it stay the entire time, but obviously you probably don't want that. You can just shrink it down for a couple seconds. So that is how to do the graphic popping up animation in Kafka. Very simple to do just like that. And those are the three edits you can do to make your videos look like Iman God. And if you want to use some magic to get captions like Iman or to create any other style, you can check it out by going to submagic.co or check out the link in the description. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to learn more tips to master short form content, and I'll see you in the next one.